Welcome to the fastest stuff in town. Today I'm going to set this Gittin Duff Ayin Ches. We are going to begin in the middle of Ayin Ches on with Aleph by the new Mishnah. Says the Masnis, Omer law, if the man says, and he ends up having a get that he's giving to her, but he instead says, Kin si I want you to acquire this document that is of debt. Oh, well, let's say she finds it behind, uh, behind him. So Kairos, she picks it up and reads it. Are you get? It's actually a get. It'll get. He actually needs to say, this is your get. Otherwise, even though he's giving her a get, she may not realize it. Says Rashi. Interesting. You could even tell her to get after she has received it. It doesn't make any difference if she knew about it before or afterwards, but the reality is at some point you have to convey what it really is. Nelson Bialdi, you give it to her hands, Vihiyashena, and let's say she's sleeping, um, and then Neoira, and then she wakes up after it's already in her hands, Kaira, when she reads it, Varihu Gitas, again, it'll get Achiyamula, He Gitech. Again, you have to let her know. Okay, says the Gemara. Ki Amrula, when he, when he spent this case of Shemat Soho Mecharev that was found behind her, Ki Amrula, when he said to her, Ha Gitech, my Havi, why should this be a good get? Havile Tli Gitech Mel Gabi Karka. The fact that she found it on the ground, we say, Vi Amrava Tli Gitech Mel Gabi Karka, Loy Merklum, it's nothing. And the answer is, Amon Shishal Pato Miacharov. It means that it was stuck by a belt from, uh, Behind, from from behind him, it says Rashi. Shall you talk of being chagayray lemasnav v'shalafulasim yisham? So shalafulasai again. If we're talking about that, it was stuck by a belt. So nami habi inan v'nasam biyad v'leika has to actually be given into her hands. But sricha de arikla chartsei u'shalafte that he moved his hips towards her and. That's how it got stuck uh, to her. So therefore, the point is that it was given, not necessarily by hand, but he kind of just like moved his body, and that's how it got close to her. Or again, it was found behind him. Karasa, she reads it, and it turns out that what she's reading is forget. So Rebbe, Rebbe holds, again, that's enough. That's all you need to do. Um, you actually have to physically take it from her, and then take it back, and then give it back. So it's not enough to say afterwards. You have to physically take the get back because it was originally given with her not knowing what it was. So therefore you have to give it back to her at the time of making the proper statement of Hegidech. Nasna biyada, let's say you put into her hands, v'hiyashen, she's sleeping, ne'oyra, she wakes up, v'kaira, she reads, v'har yu'gitas, her get, and again, atshir melua, hegidech, dibir rebi. So rebi sounds pretty much beferish, like our Mishnah. Shebri gamelua, emer, atshir t'lena, hemena, v'yasa, 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 Again, it's necessary for him to actually physically take the get back and then give it to her. Why do we need these two situations? He had more Bahak Kamaisa, the first case of her receiving the get and finding out about it. So by he karma Rebbe Misham Debas Igarushihi. She at the time is fit to be divorced right away because she's awake. There's no issue except the fact that he didn't say Hegitech. If she's sleeping, Dalabas Igarushihi. She's not someone who is. Fit to be divorced, she has no idea what's going on, she's passed out. And they have to take it back and give it to her. Only when she's sleeping are we strict to have to take it back. And that it's okay just to say, you don't have to give it back. So that's why in both cases. You wrote a get, and you gave it to her servant who happens to be Yashin sleeping. And being guarded. So how does that get? Even though it's a different person, doesn't make any difference. The fact that he's sleeping, so it's almost like putting it into her chatzar. 
And that's, as we saw in yesterday's daf, that it doesn't have to be dafka into her hands, but even chatzero, gagoy, karfifoy. So neyer, if the evid is awake, enu get. Because <coughs> he, she doesn't know, <coughs> because he's a different das, what he's thinking, what's going on. So therefore, because of that, <coughs> it's not a get. So Yoshin and Mishamar tell her as they get, the Gemara has this in so many different places. The fact that he's asleep, that also shouldn't help. Am I? Chatzimahalechas he. He's considered to be like a Chatzimahalechas, says Rashi. Rabbi Gupa Amr Mishnaim Oyks and Metalis, elsewhere. Chatzimahalechas loy kaina. So the fact that he physically can move, he can travel, that's not a Chatzar. A Chatzar has to be like stationary. That's something which is shocked to move. Shani, sleeping is different. It doesn't make any difference. Even if he's sleeping, it shouldn't work. If he's tied up, which means he's not shaykh to move. So he's like a chatzar, which is not a chatzar mahalach. He's not a chatzar, which potentially is mahalachas because he's tied up. So only in that situation will it work. Next Mishnah. Says the Mastisa. So you're in the Rosh Hashanah, so it's not in your domain, not in the woman's domain. The Zarku law, you throw it there. So Karim law, if it's closer to her, the Gemara is going to explain what that means. Begreshist, she's divorced, because it's closer to her physically. Karim law, if it's closer to him, and a Begreshist, because she didn't get it. Maxal Maxim Begreshist, and a Begreshist. If it's somewhere in between, so then it's a suffix. In Kedushin, so too if you would throw uh, Kesed Kedushin to Mimikadosh a woman that way, probably not the best way to Mimikadosh a woman, here, take, take some money and throw it at her. The Chenel in a Chayv, also paying off a loan, the dinner are the same. Armul Bal Chayv, if they, you said to your Bal Chayv, Zarkli Chayv, you throw me the money you owe me, the Zarkli and you threw, he threw it, Karbal Malve, if it's close to the lender, Zacha Malve, Karbal Loive, if it's still close to the borrower, and then let's say it gets lost, so haloi v'chayev. So the loiv is still chayev to give it back, give it, because it's not considered like he gave it. Maxal Max is somewhere in between, she named Yachloiku, so in that situation we say it's divayla. Says the Gemara, heichidemi karav lo. What does it mean it's close to her? That he threw the guy close to her. So heichidemi karav lo, what does it mean close to him? So I'm Rav Arba Amlis. It has to be within their Arba Amlis. Arba Amlis Shalom. Zeu karav lo, arba amos shaloi. If it's close to his arba amos, zeu karav lo. So hechad am mechsal mechsa. So what's half and half? So I'm Rabbi Shimon bar Rabbi Yitzchak. The guy in shaloi says shneim oindin ba arba amos. If they're both with very close to one another, and it's thrown somewhere in the middle, so it's within her arba amos, and it's also within my arba amos. So v'lichsi haimi nayu kadim. Why don't we see which one is first? Says Rashi. Why don't we see who came first? Was the woman standing standing there, then the man approached her? So then that Arba Amos was hers because she was already kind of before that other guy came. Well, maybe they came at the exact same time. We're not able to be Mimat Sam same to be exact, right? It's gotta be someone came first. El Umarav Kahana Hakabhes Amos Misum Samoy Saskina. So it's it. It can't be Masam same that they one def they both came within the same time of each other, but you could be Masam same that it was exact they're exactly eight Amos. So it says Rashi Shahayu Shnehim Oyimdim Bhes Amos Misum Samoy Slow Pachasla Yoiser Yesh Bain Shnehim. So there's my four Amos and then you're four almost, and that's exactly how far apart we are. So in that situation, they get landed somewhere smack in the middle. Okay, as we continue, I am Chesim and Beis. The get yaitzim arba almos shaloi. So if the get lands within his almos, ladal almos shaloi, and also in hers, I have a ha'agid gabe. So in that situation, we say, it should for sure not be a get. Says Rashi, a dayan ha get It's still in his rishos. Yanan v'nostam b'yodabi, and it has to be given to her. That's she kul b'rishusa. So you want to tell me it's partially in his rishus and partially her rishus is a suffix of No, 
Ella, Rabbi Mia said, Here we're talking about two different groups of witnesses. This is the meaning of suffolk, right? There's two groups of witnesses. One says it was close to him, one was close to her, so then we're unsure, and that's the suffolk. Rabbi Yochanan, no, Karvla, Shininu, it says close to her, if you may alma, even if it's a hundred almas, it doesn't have to be dollar almas. The Karvla, Shininu, if you may alma, so hey, Chenem, that's all maxa. I'm Rabbi Shem and Barabul, I didn't partially mean in the Rabbi Yochanan, this is how it's explained, who Yochul is Shimrai, if he's able to protect and guard the get, if he any Yochul is Shimrai, and she can't, so Karvla, it's like it's close to him. Close to him means he has the ability to safeguard it. Now the round, he yachayel is shem v'hu ain't a yachayel is shem v'zeu karvula. If she can guard him, but not him, so then it's considered to be like hers because it's close to her. Shnei yachayel is shem v'shem ain't yachayel. Let's say both could equally guard it, or both cannot guard it. Zel maxa ol maxa amur rabbanan. That's maxa maxa. Amur rabbanan kamei rav yochan and shemei to rav yochan and hachan. That's what I always said. Amur yadin and chavrin bavloi vrushi ki hai taima. Did you know that the people of Bobby were able to explain it in such a such a manner? It's basically uh complimentary Lukhaira. Okay. Tanya Mihachi. Rabbi Lazar Oimer Koshu Karvla. Anything which is close to her, Miloy Vokelev and not only Magrashis. If let's say let's see, is there Rashi over here? Um, it's closer to her than from him. So we're saying right now, even though it's closer to her than to him, however, and then a dog comes and takes it, so that's uh, not going to be a good guess. So, so again, what is the case? It's closer to her. So we say it's not going to be a good get. So this is going to be, it says, it says over here, Rashi, Why not? No, once it gets to her, she should automatically be divorced. So therefore that should be it. Who cares if a dog comes later on? Like, what does it mean? How long does she have to guard it? She has to guard it forever? So it just makes sense. If she gets the get and it's close and it's she's kind of and that's it that's it she's divorced two seconds later a dog grabs it. okay it doesn't change the fact that she should be divorced let's say again she's close it's closer to her than to him and then a dog comes when he's able to safeguard he ain't because she's not able to be shimer it she can't protect it and guard it that's why it's not a good get Amalei Shmuel Lerav Yehuda. Oh, hold, let's hold off for one second. Let's look at question three. Nothing get al meet. Okay, we did that already. Let's let's go back there. Amalei Shmuel Rav Yehuda. So Shmuel, focus on the name of Shmuel. He said Shinana Kedesha Tashuach v'Titlena. Kedesha Tashuach v'Titlena. What is that? Who who the Havi Kurava? That you can like bend down and take it. That's considered to be close to you. Um, that's what it's referring to. The Atul Tavid Uvda do not do this until it gets into our hands. They actually had such a situation and they required Chalitza because the uncertainty of whether or not that's actually a valid get. Question, now, question four. Mizarku Karavla Magrashas. Mahu Karavla Datana. What does it mean it's close to her? So, according to Rav, it means within her four Amos. Rav Yochan says, uh, as long as she is able to guard it and not him. And Shmuel says, Kadesha Tasuach Vatitlana. Enough that she could basically bend down and take it. So, that is the, uh, the three potential answers to this question. Okay. All right, that's going to be that for that. T A um, seventeen. Maxal maxim aggression aggressions. Ma oifin shall maxal maxa. What does happen? Half and half. What is that referring to? 
So Oshte Kiti Edim Achas Omeres Karvloi Vachas Omeres Karvlo. Right. So that's one possibility that you have two witnesses says it was close to her, two say it was close to him. So that's the suffix. Or Shnei Yichol L'Shomari B'mi the Shove. But I didn't Shnei Ein Yichol. It's in a situation where they're both able to guard it, or they're both not able to guard it. Okay. Um, Shneihem yechayin l'shamer v'shneihem ein yechayin zehu mechsa al mechsa amur. That is what it means by mechsa al mechsa. Okay, so that's the other interpretation. T A seventeen, T B seventeen. Zarku karb lo migreshes, mahu karb lo, madua ika the machmir the lo migreshes ad shegil yada. So chad mani amir karb lo dal damay. So chad mani amir mishetat mishmishamer. Another one says we're to bend down. Okay. All right. So that is TB17. So pretty similar to these other questions. All right. Now let's see. The, let's continue. Two dots. The Chinlin Kedushin. Same thing if you would throw Kedushin. It's the same thing. Actually, this is only by getting and nothing else. That's Rashi with the Um The get who the balkarcha kanuyawa because she acquires it against her will. Hilka will alter habigit to get immediately. Abba alma lo. We don't say this in other situations. Eisvi rav abba rav asi v'chen the inin kedushin. What do you mean? Our Mishnah says it does include other things. Moshani chasam dechzav yatsav ha'isa. You're right. It does include kedushin just because of this of the the din of yatsav ha'isa that we make a hekish hava litzia. So too, when it comes to loans, zarkli chayvi, throw my debt, zarku loy, and he throws it. So karvo mal is near the lender zacha, haloyve kar zacha zoycha ha malva should say right yeah zoycha malva, karvo loyve haloyve chayv maxal maxa shneim yachoku. What do you mean? It's not just my divorce. It's not just my marriage. The Mishnah says it's also by this. So how come I skin and the Ermel Azarkli Chayvi Viti Pater? It's only because he specifies says, throw me this and then you will become Pater. Says Rashi, the Patri, because he patted himself. Although Zarkli Chayvi Stam, if you just do it Stam, Zark was Shamu Kaimer. So you have to remember what's a Chiddush. If he said Viti Pater, obviously going to be Pater. Well, it's Rikha, the Ermel Azarkli Chayvi Bataris Gitten. You said throw it to me within the same same frame of laws as the gitin. You cut the mala memra. So what's the chiddush? So that you should follow the same laws. Mad of tema matzi armele. They can maybe say mishat denibacha or mishat denibach. That was just joking with you. I wasn't really being serious, um, and therefore you know you you still owe me the money. Kamash mo. Am rav chista get biyada. What happens if you have a get in your hand? In her hand, and Mashiach Abiyado, and you're like a yo yo, you have a string a t- a connected to the get. So, if you can yank the get and pull it away, and it migrashes because it's not considered to be in her hands. The Imam migrashes, my time would be in increases with Eka. Or maybe with a Haisa Yado Asoya, Ki Kataf rates, a person has a in her hand and is put down, but it's in a sloping matter, says Rashi. Midroin, uh, Russia at Boisov, Mat in the Karka, her hands are downward. When a, when we have a woman, her Kabbalah to get, we have it in cupping both hands upward like this. Here she had her hands downward, which means the get's just going to slide right off of her hands. So if she did it in this particular way, with Zarko, and you throw it, Alpha Bisha Gi get Leonov, and it hits her hands in a Magrasha. So am I. Ha Kinuffel, Barba Almosti de Kinuffel. Even if she didn't catch it in her hands, but it fell down next to her, and therefore that's with her daladalmas. No, but the loy noch, it didn't rest. Which means, um, what ended up happening, Rashi says, nisraf, it got burnt up before it hit the ground. So, but he garish me avira, the arba amos. She should be coined through the arba amos of her airspace. So, tipshit the boy Rabbi Lezra, arba amos, shamar, yeshla hen avir, or enel hen avir, tipshit the enel hen avir. So, when we have the arba amos, maybe that's only on the ground, but not the airspace. That must be the Kiddush. No, it's not a Raya, because Hachmai Skin by Yemenes al Gabi Hanar, meaning Karyul Ibn Koi. Here she's by the river. It says Rashi, the Avir Shein Roy Wanuach Loikani. You ever dealing with airspace that it, it, in that airspace through gravity, it will not rest on the ground because it's going to end up just 
falling into the river. So therefore, that is not going to count. Maybe we really do hold that Yeshel had Avir. Our Baalmos Shamer Yeshel had Avir. But in this situation, because she had her hand slanted down and it got burnt before it hit the ground and because she was by the Nahar, so therefore, because of that, everyone says, Adim Gresha's Adkaf.